Hello Hugo. Hello. Hugo, is it right? It's yeah, Hugo. You say Hugo. In Denmark in Denmark you say Hugo. Hugo. So it's yeah. Hugo. It's a hard sound. <laughs> okay. Um so far there are only a few informations about you. Yeah. Can you introduce yourself first? Of course. Um well my name is Hugo. Uh Helmi. Uh Toff Simonson, actually. That's my full name. I'm 19 years old from Denmark. Uh, I live in a city called Aarhus. I have a girlfriend and I stay with my parents. So that's a short introduction. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. Yeah. Mm, how would you describe your music? Do you have a musical concept? Hmm. No, I wouldn't say I have like a concept, but uh, I would describe it as pop music, like mainly, but with a twist of uh, all kinds of genres and, and other music. So it's You know, I think it's difficult to say because you know I, I usually don't put my music in a box, but but yeah, it's pop music. Pop yeah, music. Pop music. Yeah. Okay, thank you. And um, when you started your music career, do you have a musician that inspired you? Yeah, many, many. Uh, I think you know it. It it kind of switches. Sometimes it's one artist, and some other time it's some other artist. But you know, there's always been John Mayer that's inspired ah. me a lot. Um, I also Alicia Keys inspired me a lot too. Um, also Prince, Prince? Stevie Wonder, uh, Stevie there, Wonder. Yeah, so many. And also just I think you know everyone that's just that's that's like actual right now. You know, for example, Justin Bieber, uh, Post Malone. Right now, you know this new pop kind of sound coming through. I think uh, so. Yeah, I have a lot of uh, artists that inspire me. Can you still remember which was the first song you wrote? Ooh, no, I don't <laughs> No, Yeah, I think <laughs> maybe... It's too long ago? Yeah, no, no, uh, yeah, it is long ago. But, you know, I think one of the first songs I wrote is a song that, you know, never became a song that I did in a studio. Uh. But the first song I ever did in a studio is called One Plus One. We actually play it uh, here tonight at the show. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. So it, that's the first song I did in a studio. Yes. But I, 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 I've wrote a song before carrier. that. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Um, where do you find your inspiration? Ooh, I think uh, is everywhere. Is it your life or yeah, what you see on the course, streets? Of course, of course, it's my life. Um, I usually take like things that happened in my life uh, in the studio. You know, I think about what happened to me, what happened this like a certain situation, and then I like, you know, I use my life, but I also just use like my imagination and. So it's like a, com a combination of imagination and real life, I would say. All songs are 100% Hugo. Yeah, I w you know, I write the songs with my producer Emil, so it's me and Emil, you can mm. say. But yeah, I would say they're 100% Hugo. Mm. And can you tell me what makes a good song, in your opinion? What makes a good song? Well, When that's... Do you know I don't this is it? I don't think, you know, I have like a like a thing that makes a good song in my head. I just I just know when it's a good song for me, you know. Yeah. Some some people like opera for example, and I I I've never listened to opera, so I wouldn't say w if I heard some opera music, I wouldn't say wow, that's a good song because that's not a good song to me, you know. Um but I don't know. I don't know what makes a good song. It can be the lyrics, it can be the voice, it can be like th the instruments mm -hmm. playing the right thing, the right chords that you know. So I I think it's hard to say. Do you already had a plan B if it would what <laughs> if it <laughs> would not work with the music? No, I don't <laughs> have a plan B. <laughs> I'm actually I think I'm one of the only one of my friends that didn't go to like high school. Uh so I don't have any plan B. It's it's music or or nothing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So let's hope it works. Yeah. 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 <laughs> um mm, now you are here in Berlin. Yeah. You are Uh, on tour in Germany for mm. shows. Yeah. And um, how does it run? Oh, how does it run? Sorry, what? Run. Oh, when? Is it okay? Oh, Is yeah, it yeah, it's perfect. Yeah, really nice feeling. We played uh, Hamburg uh, two days ago and we played uh, Cologne, Cologne mm. yesterday. Uh, I think both shows went really nice. Uh, the crowd was very, you know, very psyched and okay. we're like standing close to the to the scene and yeah, I really enjoyed it. Yeah. And uh, do you have time to meet your fans? 
Yes, yeah, sure. Yes, after the after the concert. After the concert. Yeah, I go. I go after. It's I go out to the crowd. Exactly, and and sign uh, and sign the tickets. And how important is it for you to meet your fans? It's very important to me, and I think you know, seeing seeing a fan getting so happy about meeting me, you know, that's a crazy thing. I never tried that before. It's very new to me, so it's mm. it's an amazing feeling seeing someone being that happy about meeting me or meeting you in that yeah. in that setting. So yeah, it's crazy, and then. Sometimes you know, if you have met like fans a lot, you can be, oh, do I have to do it again? But when you go out there, you know, it's just as nice yeah. every time. I would say. Yeah, it's different for every musician. Exactly. One like it, one no. Yeah, yeah. Um, But I, yeah, I really, I really like it. Uh, yeah. And um, there's a single, "Please yeah. Don't Lie." Yeah. And an EP. Yeah, exactly. Can you tell us uh, when will you release an album? Well, we don't know yet. Uh, as soon as possible. Um, so I, I, it's not sure. Actually, it's going to be an album. It's maybe it's going to be like an EP more, and then combine the two EPs uh -huh. with a couple of new songs to an okay. album at some point. So, uh, so we don't know yet. I don't know yet when it's going to come, but uh, hopefully soon. Uh. Yeah. And we are today uh, in Germany for show for four shows. Yeah. And do we have a plan when you come back to Germany for more shows? Yeah, we're we're gonna do some uh, some radio shows actually in September. Uh -huh. So uh, and we're gonna play a couple of festivals in the summer. I can uh -huh. remember one called Traumzeit. Uh, I don't know where it is. I can't remember that. But uh -huh. yeah, we're coming back to Germany this summer and uh, and after the summer. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I thank you. Yeah, of course. <laughs>